Well, he's taken the first two shots, and he hasn't hit the rim yet. That's a little nerve from young player, but he's been terrific. Meanwhile, LeBron James nails a three-pointer. Two-point early lead for Miami. Berea has been so adept at getting in the paint. Nice lob, and Chandler throws it down. And James comes the other way. Pull-up jump shot. He's three for three. James again will try. Four for four. The perfect start for LeBron James. Holster and the Miami Heat. Little run to MC. They're down with the kick. James finally showing up to the party. Aggressive early on the offensive end. You're in trouble as a defense when he's knocking down James. Anthony on Davitsky. Davitsky trying to find some space. Top shot. Kicks it out, Terry for three. That's good. Jason Terry off the bench, two for two. On the next possession, Sean Marion off the double team, kicks it out to Terry, way too late. Good offense by the Dallas Mavericks. Heat up by two. For me, the thing I would look at is, as Cardinal hits a three, I would look at it this a shot at Dirk Nowitzki as Wade makes a nice play. At all in the finals as Terry steals that. Prior to last game, Terry. Side step and gets the layup to go. Difficult shot. There's obviously so big a key as they turn it over near Stevenson able to come up with it. Good scrap from Stevenson. Sets for three and knocks it down. Dallas shooting well again. They're three of five from downtown. That's good. And House comes right back. And should he have nine quick points? First quarter complete here in game six. Dallas by five. Berea, Stevenson sets for three. That's good. Well, Sean Stevenson continues his red hot shooting from downtown. Turnover. Stevenson sets, puts up another. Knocks it down again. The Sean Stevenson three for three from downtown. And Dallas is up by 12. Penetration by Berea on target pass as they have the heat scrambling around and then in transition. Good find again by Berea. Run into the three-point line. And the Dallas Mavericks are rolling. I'm sure there's a lot of young German players inspired by Nowitzki as Eddie House answers back. House with a couple of big buckets. Dallas has gone cold after being red hot early. Chandler inside. Blocked by Wayne. That's his second rejection, and against the seven-footer. House, bang! Heat back in front, timeout Dallas. Play, let's see. Let's watch the whole scenario after the big shot and there you see Haslam and Deshaun Stevenson Chandler trying to push Haslam away now Chalmers gets into it Chalmers and Stevenson going Chalmers coming in and accelerated it the officials are going to look there's a good chance Chalmers will be hit with a technical foul for sure and perhaps face possible suspension. And when it starts with Deshaun Stevenson's left-hand shove of Udonis Haskell. That's just technical foul stuff. Now right. Chalmers comes in and exasperates the situation. And then Stevenson with a hard shove on Chalmers. Joel Anthony coming in. You see the Heat players off the bench. But see James Jones? That's why Patrick Ewing got suspended. One step. Are you kidding me? I hate to go back, Mark. <laughs> The thing that's disappointing is this is the NBA Finals. I mean, this this can't happen. Hey, the, the Stevenson Haslam thing that happens all the time—a push and a shove. But Chalmers, for Chalmers to come running in and getting involved like that—that's you just have to be smart there. Really put his team in some jeopardy. Come on, the guy got pushed. You're gonna turn around. Let me tell you something. As players, we we made the same point to the league office. Chalmers inside, Haslam, nice pass, Chalmers to Haslam on the run. Here comes the double team. 
inside the Marion. Marion throws it down. Terry for three. That's good. Six of 12 from downtown. Dallas. He's had better looks tonight than many times in this series. Terry for three. Jason Terry, 17 first half points. Six men in the NBA. Continuing to be aggressive offensively, pushing the ball in transition. Nobody stops the ball. He makes them pay the price. After that, three assists as well. Halftime, game six of the NBA Finals. Dallas, a two-point lead here in Miami. Gill and trust the time that you put in. He has had a number of games in these playoffs, and there's a good start. We're Shots wide open. Both teams right now at 50% shooting for the game. Chalmers, who got the start, knocks down the three. Berea against Chalmers. Oh, pretty move from J.J. Berea. You see Berea in the pick and roll comes off. If you're Chris Bosch, you got to be in position to help. No need to go to the body of Tyson Chandler. Force J.J. Berea to give the basketball up, but give Berea credit. Stayed aggressive and got to his spot. And brings it back out. Nowitzki on the pull-up trying to draw the foul. Not able to connect. Berea is on LeBron James. Pushes off, offensive foul. That's his second foul on James. I mean, he didn't do it, but he did it right in front of him. That was an easy call. And, and I like this substitution of Cardinal for Mahimi. Kidd turns and fires. Jason Kidd from downtown. Only his second shot attempt in his first points of the night. 20. Davitsky will try another three. Puts it in. Davitsky, his first three-pointer. Responsibility. He cheats the play. Great pass by Brian Cardinal. On point, on target jump shot by Dirk Davitsky. Let his feelings be known. Not a tech. And you're also going back to the last he thought, but still. You Jason Kidd has to throw it up, and he puts it in. Shot clock winding down. Point shooting, just incredible, Mark. Oh, you're talking about an all-time great, not just point guard, but player. Jason Kidd has dreamt of this moment. And he trying to find his way out there. Terry to Mahimi. He's going to put up the shot, and he puts it in at the buzzer. Jan Mahimi with a big shot for the Dallas Mavericks, and they'll lead by nine. Kept it alive first with the offensive rebound. And then Mahimi able to knock it in. Just his second field goal of the finals. Berea on Wade. John was saying go down. Nice backdoor Wade to the basket. Counted and a foul. With his sixth assist. Good job of trusting Chalmers. Poor defense by Berea. Dirk Nowitzki tries to hard foul him. The strength, the athletic ability. But Dwayne Wade takes the hit and finishes. Outstanding. Has a look where he's ready to take over this basketball game. Berea puts it in. J.J. Berea from downtown. Glad to see Florida. Pick and roll offense. Gets Eddie House on his heels. Late contest. And J.J. makes him pay the price. Aims on Terry. Terry to Nowitzki. Nowitzki open jump shot. Knocks it down. Kid to Chandler. Chandler brings it back out. Nowitzki on the pull-up. Puts it in. Ten-point game with 3.40 to play. And up in the air to pass. Wade comes back. Drives on Marion trying to draw contact. Oh, difficult shot from Wade. That's the way they should play. Nowitzki puts it up. Puts it in. Dirk Nowitzki makes it a ten-point game. Oh, but great players are just like death and taxes. Sooner or later, they're going to get you. Dirk, eight big points in the fourth quarter. Dwindle down the clock, and then outstanding, unstoppable jump shot. That thing is pretty, and the boss man knows it. The fourth quarter has been Dallas's here in these finals. Terry off the dribble, pulls up. That's good. Jason Terry nails it, and it's back to 12, equaling the largest lead of the game. A 27-point brilliant performance from Jason Terry. Under two minutes remaining. James nails a three. And some of the fans now heading for the exits. The Dallas Maverick fans starting to celebrate. 
Novinsky, left hand, lays it in, and it's 103-92, and that should do it for the Dallas Mavericks. The Mavericks celebrating on the bench. Chalmers tied up. Turnover, Dallas ball, and the Mavericks will do it as Bosch fouls with 18.8 seconds remaining. Mark Cuban starting to celebrate behind the Dallas bench. And only fitting, Mama, there goes that man, Dirk Nowitzki, sealing the deal. The Dallas Mavericks bench realizing that the jewelry is theirs. Well done. From the Miami Heat, the phones are wide open. Everybody is for sale. 16.1 seconds remaining. Terry gets it. And the Heat will not foul. Sean Marion dribbles it out. And the celebration will begin. The Dallas Mavericks are NBA champions. The first title in franchise history. The emotions of Dirk Nowitzki, what he's always dreamed of, hoping to have another chance after the bitter loss in 2006. An unlikely playoff run capped off by Dallas upsetting LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, and the favorite Miami Heat. Meanwhile, you see for the Miami Heat a stunning ending to one of the more compelling seasons in NBA history. A bitter finish to a year that was really championship or failure, according to most people, including the Miami Heat players. And now it's going to be a long, painful summer before they get a chance to respond. As we said, they came together here in the Eastern Conference playoffs, but it all came apart after taking a 2-1 to -one lead in this best-of-seven series. Now is it only a temporary setback for the Heat or a learning experience and part of the growth of a future champion? We'll have to wait to find out. As Mark Cuban gets to celebrate, I'm sure he'll be glad to talk now. He's been quiet throughout the entire postseason. You can't help but to felt, feel great about this Dallas Mavericks team. From top to bottom, a true team. Outstanding job. Their resilience, their ability to fight back and to follow the lead of their best player, and their leaders. Great, great job by the Dallas Mavericks, Rick Carlisle, Mark Cuban, and the entire organization. Well, it's a team in recent years that has had strong regular seasons followed by playoff disappointments, which is what Miami's going through right now. 2006 finals, some typical playoff losses since then, but these two longtime teammates are NBA champions here tonight. in the mass of people. NBA Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban joins us now. Mark. Mark, 11 years ago, you purchased this team. What does this accomplishment mean? You know what? And the MVP of this series with an average of 26 points and almost 10 rebounds a game, Dirk Nowitzki. for game six. Mavs win, they're champions. Terry for three. Jason Terry, 17 first half points. Nowitzki on the pull up, puts it in. 10 point game. Final game of the NBA season and final game for our partner, the new coach of the Golden State Warriors, Mark Jackson. We are thrilled for you. We're heartbroken you're leaving, but good buddy. Best of luck to everything. We're going to miss you like you have no idea. Thank you. Love you guys, man. Really appreciate your extreme blast and blessing. Thanks for watching ABC, home of the NBA Finals.